hey guys welcome back so in this video i'm gonna show you how you will use the print command in indirect mode in gw basic so basically what is indirect mode as i stated earlier in my previous videos indirect mode is when you don't have uh, a program that will be executed uh, indirect mode is when you type a command you give the pc and uh, you give the uh, computer a, uh, a command and it is executed as soon as you press the enter or the return key on your keyboard so there are basically no numbers uh, before every line in, 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 the, in the indirect mode while there are uh, numbers uh, we have to number every line in a program so we'll go to that portion uh, later on so what basically is indirect mode as I stated indirect mode is when you don't have a program uh, for executing the statements or um, executing uh, um, something uh, sequentially so indirect mode is when you give PC a command and it executes it as soon as you and uh, as you uh, you press the enter key so secondly what is the print command so the print command allows you to display anything on the computer screen uh, you can say that it is used to communicate uh, with the computer uh, you uh, give it uh, you give the print command to the computer you want anything to display for example your name you type your name you want to print your name on the screen it will print your name on the screen and so there are uh, two uses of the print command uh, basically the first one is that it can be used to display letters numbers or symbols and the second one is it can be used to evaluate numerical expressions so I'll show you that For those of you who are not sure what I did in this step, just go to my previous video in which I have shown how you will uh, run GW Basic in Windows 7, 8 or 10. So I'll just show you how you will use, uh, as I stated earlier that in indirect mode, you don't type a line number. You don't have to type a line number and you give the computer a command and it executes it as soon as uh, you kind of press enter key so let's just start here by <coughs> using the typing in the print command here so as I stated earlier it can be used and there are two uses uh, of, of the print command it can be used to display anything you want to display and secondly it can be used to evaluate expressions numerical expressions so I'm, I'm I will just uh, show you guys how you can show anything on the screen I'll just time in, uh, type in something like this so here is what I want to uh, what I want the computer to, to display on the output screen as I, as soon as I would press the enter or the return key now it would display uh, this portion which I typed earlier between these strings so anything that you want the computer to display as it is you will place that inside strings so I wanted the computer to, to display um, this sentence or phrase and uh, so it displayed it and uh, I had to place strings in order to make the computer understand to convey my message that I want this to appear as it is in the output so this was the first use of the print command so now uh, going to the second use that is uh, it can be used to evaluate numerical expressions so how would you do that so you will type the print command here and for example I had to add two numbers I would type for the first number and the second number then I would press enter and it would give me the sum I wanted to calculate sum of these two numbers 67 and 79 so I used the print command I didn't didn't use strings because if I had used uh, used strings it would display what I typed is at uh, as it as it is so let's just for better understanding I will type this again inside strings 
see the, the computer will then uh, display what I typed inside strings rather than displaying their output their sum so one final time I will just show you the combining what happens when we combine both of these so for example I say my name is so now I want uh, this uh, uh, sentence to appear as it is and uh, I would kind of well let's just discard it I will show you some other so basically we want to sum these two numbers the sum of twenty five and twenty five is then I would close the strings because I want this part to appear in the output as it is and now I will give it um, the numbers I want to add and it will perform the numerical operation it has to on this part of the program so you see the first part will appear as it is because I enclosed the first part inside of strings the second part however was not enclosed inside strings and so it did not appear as it is and the print command performed numerical a uh, numerical uh, operation on these two numbers so this was all about the print command in the next video we're gonna be looking at how we can um, uh, make programs we're gonna be discussing um, about the program mode